Failure to stop a dangerous and ongoing problem for anyone trying to get around Metro Detroit. We thank you for staying with us this afternoon. I'm Glenda Lewis. And I'm Brian Abel. A father in Melvindale says he's fed up with drivers who don't have the patience to stop. Take a look. One by one, you see drivers blowing right past that stop sign in his family's neighborhood. It's one of two problem spots on South Dearborn Street. But as 7 Action News reporter Kimberly Craig shows us, the problem goes beyond this one community. Eric McCausland and his fiance Sarah couldn't believe how people were disregarding the stop signs here. Even Melvindale police say it's a problem. It's gotten worse since the construction. These cars do not care. This was the scene in front of their home yesterday. Vehicle after vehicle most failing to stop. Melvindale police say too many drivers here on South Dearborn Street are treating obvious stop signs at Wood Street and Harmon Street as if they're yield signs when the law dictates that you must come to a complete stop. Ever since that construction zone right there on the train bridge on Oakwood. It's just it's increased exponentially. This is what's caused the increase in traffic. Oakwood Boulevard just south of 94 is blocked, leading drivers onto Enterprise Drive, which turns into South Dearborn Street, where the speed limit is 25. We had people doing it before, but it, it was, you know, five, 10 cars a day. Now it's like five, 10 cars every 10 minutes. This yellow sign even warns drivers to watch for children. It's pretty frustrating. You know, we've got, you know, between the two of us, we've got, you know, five kids and they were out here playing and you know, obviously we're sitting out here because we don't want anything to happen to them. And the problem is in cities everywhere. This week, the city of Detroit will be announcing the locations of 4,500 speed humps, some asphalt and some rubber like this. In Melvindale, police recently began using a speed monitoring device because that's a large part of why they say people are failing to actually stop. These people going so fast that one little thing loses control, they end up over the curb and, and hurting somebody. Slow down. Stop. Pay attention. Pay attention. And Melvindale police say they'll be back out with more patrols. They actually sent out a couple cars and they were pulling people over left and right. For the stop sign. For the stop sign. It was great. It slowed traffic down that day for the next day or so. And then yesterday being such a nice day, people must have forgotten. And there are actual lives that can be saved if we were all just more conscious about stopping when the light is red or when the sign says stop. In Melvindale, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News. Thank you, Kim. And failing to stop at a stop sign can cost you big. In Wayne County, that's a $130 fine. And in Michigan, it's three points on your driving record that can lead to higher insurance rates and put your right to drive in Michigan in jeopardy.